going good so far. We're currently at four out of the seven stations. Some of the stations that we've made through, like electrical and also the course where we go around the whole track, there's very small things that we have to switch. However, last night though, we did have a small problem with telemetry, but we stayed up till 12 and we did get that done and the car is working again, so we managed to get through station 6 today. We are eventually going to get through station 7 later today, which is a box truck drive by and hopefully all will go well and we're looking good. Uh, hi, my name is Nick Tracy. I am part of the build team and yeah. What's been doing well so far? Uh, so far for Scrutineering, we've been able to accomplish five of the seven um, stations so far. We are about to go and finish up our electrical station and overall, I mean, the whole car has been a real success. All the judges have loved it. The paint scheme looks great and we're just having a blast out here. Uh, one of the more difficult things is trying to stay, I guess, mentally prepared for this. Everyone's kind of on edge or a little bit with the stress, the hot weather, and just not being able to cool down is really just being a hard time for the team and just, I mean, everyone's getting to each other. But other than that, I think, I think we can overcome it. And then what are you excited for after Uh I am excited to get up on the road and explore these new states and towns, cities, see what the whole desert has to offer to us along this journey. Hello, I'm Braden Haversack, the build team lead for the Horizon Solar Car team. And uh, we're down here in Texas today and scrutineering so far has been going pretty good. Uh, we've gone through almost everything first try. We haven't had much struggles. We've been very good for first car teams. We've had many compliments from other teams, judges saying that we've been impressively well for a first year team. And that's been a good thing. We had, did have some minor struggles yesterday with some cracked welds after a struggle. We hit two wheels on the slalom, but we got that fixed right up. And then we had some minor issues with telemetry in the car. But after we got fixed those, after a late night yesterday, we were able to uh, get the car back and running and out here for today. We have electrical station to go through again, just make sure everything's good, and one more station to finish, and we'll be completely finished with scrutineering. Um, and we had one crazy moment I remember is the fact that he went up on two wheels and it was, he hit the back corner on the ground, which is pretty impressive because that's like 30 degrees in the air, which is quite, quite far. My name is Mr. Domer and I'm the lead advisor for the Burning Daylight Watertown's solar team this year uh, for 2022-23. We are here at day three of scrutineering in Fort Worth, Texas. Uh, three days of 100 degree heat, sweating, uh, working out here outside like we are thankfully in the shade under the building, uh, but it has been brutal uh, for us Wisconsinites hanging down here. We've had some amazing ups and downs while we're here the last three days. Uh, specifically in scrutineering, we've been in Fort Worth for five days now, but um, man, we've had some ups and downs. We've passed a whole bunch of our uh, scrutineering sessions. We've run into some complications. Um, we've had ups and downs as the team, but in the end, uh, so far, we are gaining so many experiences as students and adults through communication, uh, what we're doing here. I think that's the number one thing I'm taking away as a team. It's, it's amazing to have this vehicle that we've built for the last year behind us, raised the funding, got all the way down here. It's great. Uh, but one of those things that people don't realize is all the soft skills being built that we're going to be taking away from this experience uh, in time. One of those lows was yesterday afternoon, everything's going real smooth, uh, getting through scrutineering checks, and then boom, battery stops working. So now we're left to scrutineering. What do we do? team jumps, packs it in the trailer, takes it to the hotel, works through the night uh, as a team struggling to make it through that. But we got the car running again and here we are again today. And those experiences that students are going through uh, is once in a lifetime. These are things they're gonna take with them. So I'm really excited to see us on the track, on the race here in the next couple of days. If we can get the last couple checks behind me done today um, and get out there on the open road on our way to Los Angeles. The kids have been really excited today. We got our first time out on the track uh, and did our uh, station six of driving around, practicing loading, unloading, and just brings the spirit of the team up to get that car moving. So I can't wait for tomorrow morning's start uh, to get on the road and get us past the scrutineering session. Mm -hmm.